Uh, I've been out here long enough today. Got quite a bit painted. Seat pans, the hydraulic hose mount or hydraulic valve mount. Um, your hood rest. It's the bonnet. There's the tunnel cover. There's the lower grill, the dash, the, sh the um, dash tower, hood, a bunch of other parts. Uh, I didn't paint that. Didn't have to. Um, all that's really left is the fender and the frame. I got to uh, take these seat springs off and paint them. And the uh, engine, I think I'm just going to power wash and uh, I'll just leave it all together like that. I might mask off a couple things. Oh, uh, I got to do my gas tank holders and the steps. Uh, I haven't got the steering box yet. Just trying to get basically all the sheet metal primed and you know get it primed and uh, let it sit a day or so. Even though primer you can hit almost right away, but uh, you know it's I don't know. I'll just let it dry. I got nothing, nothing to really worry about. But uh, I got to do the front axle and I got to do the rear axle. Rear axle I'm just gonna paint as one unit. <clears throat> Leave it pretty much just like it is. But then I'm going to power wash it and take off the wheels. Um, that way I can get a better shot. And i got to cap off the uh, these valves. Um, or, I don't know, if that goes to the hydraulic valve. Or just the return line and the pressure line. So, uh, i got to tape them off or something. And uh, put some paint on this thing. So uh, you can see there's a bunch of grease there, so like I said, so I want to power wash it and then I'll uh, throw some paint on it and uh, be good to go pretty soon. I'll we'll have to start reassembling pretty soon. So, uh, Alright, I figured I'd show you guys a video. Getting somewhere. Another couple days I should be able to get mostly everything painted here, at least in primer. And then I'll have to go along and see which ones I want need to paint white and see what needs to be black and yellow. And uh, go from there. Alright guys. See you later.